Good morning. Um, hope everyone's well. Um, so it is 31 minutes past. I just logged in there at around half past. So I'll just give it another minute or so and we will begin. Okay. So if you just want to have your mat rolled out or if you don't have a mat, just find a comfortable, soft place on the floor. And um, yeah, so all we, all we need is ourselves um, and I'll bring you through about uh, 30, 35 minute maybe, could be a little bit longer, but we'll try to keep it nice and quick. Um, yeah, and that, that's it. Um, so if you want to let me know who's, who's logged in there, that'd be great. Um, yeah, and I'll just give it another 30 seconds there and we will start. So we're going to start in a cross-legged seat position on our mat, okay? So just to warm up the shoulders and the neck. So if you have a block and you, or a book or something that you want to sit on just to make yourself a little bit more comfortable, then feel free to do so. Um, and yeah, so just another couple of seconds there and we will start. I'll just get my timer sorted. Perfect. Okay, so we will pop down onto our mats. Let's pop off this. Perfect. Okay, so just coming down onto our mats. We're going to come into a cross leg position. Okay, so just crossing the legs over, just sitting up nice and tall. So we're feeling those sit bones down onto the mat. Okay, so we're just going to sit up. Nice and tall. So a nice straight line from your tailbone all the way up to the crown of the head. So no rounding of them shoulders. Open up, relax the shoulders, back and down our spine. Great. Just place your hands onto your knees. Is everything comfortable? If you want to pop them down onto the floor, just for a little bit more support, then feel free to do so. Okay. So we're just going to close the eyes here first. And we're just going to drop the chin down towards the chest. Great, so just taking a nice few deep breaths here. So just opening up the back of the neck. Great. So try, again, try not to collapse forward. Keep them shoulders back as, you, as your chin is to your chest. Great, then we just want to start to roll our chin. So we're just going to roll our chin across our collarbone, nice and gently. Great. Just be mindful of your neck, nice and gentle. Just rocking it from side to side. Okay, so just let the neck open up, let it hang loose. Great. Super. Now bring it into full rotation. So again, taking it nice and easy. Just letting that neck open up. We do one more in this direction and then switch your direction. Great. So just walk in direction, either left or right, whichever way you haven't gone. Great. Super. And drop that chin all the way down to the chest. Great. And bring the head back to center. Super, okay, so we're just gonna roll our shoulders now. Just make a nice circles with the shoulders, bring them all the way forward, great, and roll them up. Super. So we'll get two more in this direction. Great, last one, and then we'll swap directions. Super, I'm bringing it back the opposite way. Bring it to that last one in this direction. And super. Perfect, okay. So we're gonna come down now onto our mat. So coming over, we're gonna come down. Let's just place the feet about hip width apart. Bend the knees, great. Sitting up nice and tall. Let's take them hands out in front and let's just roll ourselves down onto our mat. So nice and gently, just roll it all the way down onto the mat. Super, and relax down, super back. Let's take them knees into the chest. Let's just give ourselves a little rock here from side to side. Great. Bring it into a full circle if you wish. 
So bring that lower back all the way down, bring the knees right around, and then switch directions. Or if you're happier, just going side to side, that's absolutely perfect. So just massage out that lower back from our back. Great. Super. Let's take those feet back down onto the mat. Great, just bring your hands to the side, relax the shoulders down. We're just going to windshield wiper the knees from side to side. So from right to left, or left to right, whichever suits you. Great. So just loosening out that lower back. Perfect. Great. And we will come back to center. Great. Just walk them heels in as close as you can towards the bum. Great. Let's relax those shoulders. So just bring the shoulders together. Let's just slightly tuck the chin in. So we're just going to do our 50-50 here on the mat. So all we're doing is moving our pelvis forward and imprinting the pelvis down into the mat. Okay, so it's nice and gentle. Just keep your hands down by your side. As I said, keep those shoulders relaxed, chin slightly tucked. Great. So it's kind of like we were doing our cat cat. So we're just going to Roll that pelvis all the way forward that you're arching that lower back. So really arching that lower back. And then we're just going to flatten that lower back down into the mat. Great. So we're going to inhale. We're going to arch the lower back right up off the mat. And then we're going to exhale. We're going to imprint that lower back into the mat. Great. We'll go for three more rounds. Nice and slow. Great, last two. So inhaling forward and exhaling to imprint. Great, last one now. Inhale all the way forward and exhale. Imprint that lower back into the mat and let's keep that lower back imprinted down into the mat. Super, we're going to take our hands now. We're just going to place them onto our tummy. We're just going to focus in on that breath, okay? So as we inhale, we want to feel that tummy expand. So you want to send that breath right down into the tummy. So we'll take a nice deep breath in through the nose. Great. Fill that tummy right up. And then we're going to exhale, let it out through the mouth. Great. And you're going to hold that belly button back towards the spine. Great. We're going to do three more here. Nice deep breath in. Fill that tummy up. And exhale, let's release everything back out, holding that belly button right back towards the spine. Great. Inhale. And exhale. Great. So we're really feeling that tummy right. The last one now. Inhale, feel the hands lifting up. And exhale, let's release everything out. Super. So we'll just keep the hands, place them back down by your side. So we're just going to, again, with that breath. So as we're holding that belly button back, we want to imagine that we're lifting up that pelvic floor at the same time. So really focus in on that now. Our hands are down by your side. Just take it close to the eyes. Let's take a deep breath in. As we exhale, let's blow out through our mouth like we're blowing out through a straw, nice and slow. Hold the belly button back towards the spine and start lifting up that pelvic floor. Great, we'll go for three more rounds. Nice deep breath in. And exhale, release. Super, last two. Exhale, hold the belly button back, pull or lift up that pelvic floor. So no other part of our body is moving, we're staying nice and still. Last one now. And exhale. Great, so let's just start to bring in some movement. So remember, we're keeping that lower back imprinted down into that mat, okay? We're bringing our arms down by our side, so let them hover off the mat, okay? And we're gently just going to start to crunch up, okay? So heels are in underneath the knees, arms are by your side, they're lifted up off the mat. We're going to take a breath in and as we exhale, we're going to 
Peel the earth, shoulders and head up off the floor. Exhale up and then inhale back to Great. So it's nice and gentle. We'll go for eight in total. So inhale, exhale up. Great. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Three more. Six. Seven. Eight. Great. Down. Relax. Back down. Super. So this time now, we're going to bring our legs up to a tabletop position. So our lower back still down onto the floor. We're going to bring our legs up. So the knees are coming up over the hips. Let's bring our legs together. So glue the thighs together, the knees, the ankles together. So same again. Let's take a breath in and exhale up. One. Again, we'll go for eight. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, and eight. Great. Relax down. Drop the feet down for a second. If we need to readjust, lower that back into the floor. Great. And we'll come back up. Bring them legs up to a tabletop position. Super. Now we're going to begin. We're going to lift the head and shoulders up off the floor. We're going to try to keep them up off the floor. Okay. So now we're just going to start to move the arms. So we're going to reach back with the arms. And then we're going to pull the arms down by our side, okay? So we're keeping that lower back down into the floor, knees over the hips, okay? We'll get ready to go. So reach right back and let the arms come by the side. Great. Inhale up. Exhale, arms by the side. Two. Three. Four. Five. Three more. Six, seven, and eight. Let's keep the arms by the side. This time now we're just going to move the legs. So we're going to reach the legs out in front to about 45 and pull them back in. So again, we'll go for eight reps. So we'll reach out. Ready? Pull them back in. One, two, three, four. Five, six, two more, seven, and eight. Great, relax then, shoulders down, bring the knees to the chest, give yourself a little rock side to side. Super, this time now we're going to bring the two together. So we're going to be reaching the arms back and then the legs out long. Okay, so when we come up, great, so our arms are going to stay by our side. Then we're going to pull our arms back, reach our legs out long. Okay, so we're coming in and then reaching out. Okay, super. So we'll get ready to go, guys. Let's make sure that lower back is planted into the floor. Great, bring them legs to the tabletop. Glue the legs together. Arms by the side, let's lift up. Great. So it's opposite way, so we're lifting and right out. Okay, let's get ready to go in three, two, one. So eight reps, reach up. One, two. Three, four, five, great, last three, six, seven, eight, and relax, great, hug the knees to the chest, gently little rock here, from side to side, super, so we're going to come into our single leg stretch now, okay, so plant the feet down, imprint the lower back, Great, let's bring the knees up and we're just going to lift the head and shoulders up off the floor, chin slightly tucked. Let's lengthen out that right leg, bring the left leg knee in towards the chest. We're going to hold here for a count of five, four, three, two, and one. Let's gently swap over, left leg lengthens, right knee comes towards the chest. Hold for five, four, three, two, one, let's swap over. So nice and gently, we're going to alternate here for 16 reps. Bring back to the right. Two, left, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, bring four more. Nine, 
10, 11, 12. Bring, bring forward, knees in. Little wrap from side to side. Great. And then we're going to come it up. So we're going to carry these two moves together. And the second and third time we go through, we're going to go a little bit quicker, okay? So our second one with that move is going to be our full extent. So similar to what we were just doing, we're going to reach in towards those ankles and then we're going to reach out nice and long, okay? So we're going to reach for those ankles and reach long. So we'll do eight of these, okay? So off we go. Reach for the ankles. Reach long. One, two, three, four. Keep the head and shoulders up if we can. Five, six, seven, and eight. Bring your last down. Knees to the chest, little rock from side to side. So we're going to pair those two exercises together next. So we're going to go straight from one to the other. So a little bit of a burn. So we're going to start with reach that right leg long, left knee to the chest, and we're going to lift the head and shoulders up. So head and shoulders are nice and relaxed. If it becomes too much, just let them come to the floor, okay? So we're going to go for 12 reps here in total. Off we go. So one, swap, two, swap, three, swap, four, bridge, five, six, Seven, eight, brilliant, last four, three, two, one, brilliant, bring both knees to the tabletop, head and shoulders up, reach for those ankles, reach long for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, great, relax here for 10 seconds, knees to the chest, little rock side to side, and one more round of those two exercises, okay? Great, so starting again, hug that left knee and lengthen out that right leg, lift the head and shoulders up, great, so 12 reps in total, ready to go in three, two, one, great, little pulse, and swap, great, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, last two, eleven, twelve, bring four knees to tabletop, let's reach for those ankles, reach away, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, great, relax down, knees to the chest, little rock from side to side, great, we're going to take the arms to the shoulder height, palms down, we'll get a little twist here, so just drop the knees over to the right hand side, take your gaze over that left shoulder, great, pull back to centre, and swap, knees to the left, look over the right, great, and come back, to centre. Great, let's drop the heels down. I'm going to come into our double leg bridge and our single leg bridges, okay? So let's start, let's get those heels in underneath the knees. Great. So arms are down by the side, shoulders are pulled together, nice and relaxed, chin is slightly tucked, okay? So we're going to go for eight reps for our double leg bridge. So we're going to exhale to press up through the heels, we're going to lift up the pelvis, and the lower back, and then we're gently going to release back down. So we're going to exhale to lift up. So we'll go for eight reps. Great. So off we go. Exhale, press the heels, lift up. Great. And slowly down. One, two, three, four, four more. Five, six, seven, and eight. Brilliant, super guys, okay. So we're gonna come up now into that bridge position and then we're gonna do our single leg work, okay? So we're gonna exhale, let's come up into that bridge, we lift those hips up, great. So we're gonna start, we're gonna lift the left leg up, okay? 
So we're going to lengthen out that left leg. So knees are in line. Great. So if we're going to hold here first for a count of 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Great. Now we're going to lift that leg straight up. Hips up. Great. We're going to lower that left leg in line with the right. Great. And lift. So we're going to go for 8 and toe. Great. So 8. 7. Six, five, four, three, two, three, and one. Great. Let's bring that leg straight up and we're going to hold. Press through that right heel for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, great. Let's bring that left foot down onto the floor and we're going to swap side. So we're going to bring that right leg now in line with that left. Point the toes up and hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's lift up and lower. Just the knee, left knee and up for 7, 6. Five, four, press up through that left heel, three, two, one, up and hold, brilliant, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, let's lower that right foot down, let's squeeze up, squeeze through them heels, double leg bridge for ten, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it. Let's lower all the way down. Lower back. Plant it into the floor. Bring it. Okay. We're going to come into our toe taps now from here. So we're going to bring our legs up again to the tabletop position. We're going to drop one toe, one foot down at a time and pull back up. Okay. So you can keep the head and shoulders down, or we can lift the head and shoulders up, keeping the arms by the side, dropping one foot down at a time, okay? So we'll go for 12 reps in total. So ready to go in three, two, one, up we go. So toe tap for 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Five, four, three, two, one. Great. Let's take the hands to the back of the head. We're going to go for our elbow to knee. Off we go. So we're reaching right over and pull back. We're going to go for 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Five, four, three, two, one. Great. We're going to come back to the toe tap while you relax the head or keep the head and shoulders up. Off we go for 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. Great. Hands to the back of the head. Elbow to knee for 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, bridge, arms by the side, toe tap, we're going for 12 again, so last round, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12, bridge, hands to the back of the head, let's go, last 12, 11, 10, 
Gentle at the rock from side to side. Two more exercises down here in your back, then we're going to come to our tabletop position. So we're going to do our leg lowers and our hollow holds together, okay? So for our leg lowers, we're going to again have that lower back planted into the floor. Our legs are going to come straight up, okay? <clears throat> we can keep the head and shoulders down onto the floor. Or again, you can lift them up, cross the arms over the chest, lift the head and shoulders up, and it's the same. So just lower one leg as far as you can and pull back up, okay? So alternating from left to right. Our hollow hold then. The both legs are going to come straight. We're going to release our hands by our side. Keep Just lower the legs ever so slightly that we're not arching that lower back. So for there, that's perfect for me. Some people might be directly, or some people could be very low, okay? So there are two exercises. Again, we're going to go for three rounds, one after the other. Take your break if you need to. Always reset if you need to. <laughs> and yeah, so three rounds. We'll do 12 reps and a 27 hold of our hollow hold. Okay, guys? So let's bring both legs straight up towards the ceiling. Lower back is planted on the floor. Our lower back never arches, okay? So keeping it planted. And keep your arms by your side, head and shoulders down, or cross them over and lift up, okay? We'll get ready to go in three, two, one. Off we go. Great. So alternating from left to right for 12. Great. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10, 11, 12. Bring both legs straight, arms by your side, palms up, hold it for 20. Bring Super, last 15. Lower back into the floor, shoulders relaxed. Point those toes. Last five, four, three, two, one. Bring legs straight up. Drop down right shoulders if you need to. And we'll go again for our 12 leg lowers. So drop them down and pull it up for 12. Great. <clears throat> Great. Halfway, six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Great, legs straight, let's lift the head and shoulders up. Hold for 20 seconds, off we go. Great, squeeze on the quad muscles, tuck the chin to the chest, point the toes, 10 gone, 10 to go. Great, last five, four, three, two, one. Great, we'll just take the knees to the chest, a little rock from side to side here. Super, and we'll get there ready to go again. Our last round, lift the legs straight up. Great. And we'll get ready to go for our 12 reps. Off we go, nice and slow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, last four. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Great. Let's lift the head and shoulders up. Great. Last one, 20 seconds. Off we go. Great. Squeeze on those quads. Shoulders relaxed. Super. Ten up. Great. Last five. Four, three, two, one, hug the knee into the chest, little rock here, side to side. Great, now we're going to roll ourselves up, okay? So we're going to start to roll up and down on that spine. Great, like a ball, all the way up. Great, we're going to separate the legs out, sit up nice and tall. We're going to reach right up, great. 
And we're going to exhale all forward, tuck the chin to the chest. Great. Little stretch here. Three, two, one. Walk the hands back in. Super. Let's come over into that tabletop position, okay? So we'll just mobilize that spine. We're going to cat cow. So we're going to bring the hands in underneath the shoulders, knees in underneath the hips, feet are flat. Great. Let's mobilize the spine. Let's take a breath in. Tailbone high. Drop the belly button, lift the chest, pull the shoulders down and away from the ears. Let's exhale. Tuck the chin to the chest. Press the hands to the floor. Round the spine up. Pull the that belly button in. Tailbone tucked in. Bring and inhale forward again. Exhale to round up. Great. Two more. Great. Last one. Great. So we're going to keep our hands in underneath our shoulders, okay? So we don't want to round that lower back. So we don't want to have that lower back, the tailbone stuck to the ceiling. So just gently tuck that tailbone under. When we keep that lower back as flat as we can, okay? So we're going to start now with our Superman. So we're going to be lifting our right arm and left leg. So alternating sides. So all we want to do is we're going to reach out and then we're going to exhale, just bring them both down. Okay, so little to no movement across that lower back, across the spine. Okay, so it's a general movement. We're not rounding up. Okay, we'll come to that. So we're going to reach out on the inhale. Exhale in. So we'll go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great. Next swap side. Just take a second. Great. Tailbone tucked in under. You should feel that core fire on because we're trying not to rock from side to side. And we're keeping our lower back as flat as possible, okay? So we'll go with that left side now. So let's reach out with the left arm, right leg for one. Great, back in. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Great, okay. We're going to come back to that right hand and left leg now and this time we're going to reach away and then we're going to bring the forearm and the knee together and tuck the chin to the chest okay so this time we want the spine to rest okay all right okay let's reach out let's exhale bring the two together chin to the chest we're going to go for eight seven six five Four, three, two, one. Great. Let's swap sides. So again, take a second. Let's swap over. Let's reach up. Great. Pull the two in together. For one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven and eight. Great, very long. Super. So now we're just going to work on the legs, so the glutes and the hamstrings here. So we're going to keep our hands in underneath our shoulders. We're going to tuck that tailbone in slightly. So we want to still maintain that nice lower back, nice flat back, okay? So we're going to start in that right leg. We're going to kick back. Great. Super. And from here now, we're going to bring the heel towards the bum and straighten out, okay? So I can see my lower back round in there. So I'm gonna keep it as flat as possible, okay? So we're just kicking the heel towards the bow and lengthen legs. So we'll go for eight reps, okay? So kick the heel towards the bow and straighten for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two and one. Okay, and let's relax down. Let's swap sides. Left leg back. Straighten it out. Tailbone tucked. 
Let's bring the heel towards the bow man, lengthen for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great. We're going to come back to that right leg now. Let's lift that right leg up. Great. We're going to bring just the knee up and down. So we're going to flex the foot. We're going to kick the heel up towards the ceiling and bring back down. So we're maintaining that nice flat lower back all the time. Let's get ready to go in three, two, one. Let's kick. And we for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great. Let's swap over left leg. Flex the toes. Kick straight up with the seat on the back heel for eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. Great. Super. Now we're going to come all the way down onto our tummy side. Great. We're going to leave the lower back, our back extensions here. So press the feet into the floor, squeeze on the glutes. We're going to take the hands. We're going to interlock the fingers and just place them on the forehead. Okay? So shoulders nice and relaxed. Not, or pressing the legs into the floor, squeeze the glutes. Feet press into the floor, and then we're going to lift up the chest and lower back down. So we're going to go for eight reps in total, okay? We're going to be here, guys. So another just start to find to do out this. So eight reps. Let's lift up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And eight, bring it relax down. We're just going to place the hands in underneath the shoulders and then we're going to press this back into that thigh pose just to let that lower back relax. Great, now we're going to just come into our, four, our forearm hands. So bring the elbows in underneath the shoulders, fingers forward. We're going to come into our forearm plank and then we'll be finishing up. Okay, so fingers facing forward, shoulders relaxed. Curl the toes, squeeze on the quads, and let's lift up. Great. So squeeze and up. Hold the belly button towards the spine. Perfect. So we're going to hold for another 20 seconds. Bring it back. Keep it going. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great. Drop the knee. Keep hips back on the heels. Relax. Great, let's bring the hands in underneath the shoulders, tuck the toes under, lift the hips up towards the ceiling, back downwards up, alternate the heels from left to right. Great, and we'll gently walk the feet up towards the hands. Great, so rolling up from the bottom of the spine all the way up to standing position. Great, super guys, I hope you enjoyed. So just nearly the 40 minutes there. Um, enjoy the rest of your day um, and we'll see you all again soon. Thanks, Minion. Bye.